Hey guys, welcome back to Bernard from the BTN HD. And yes, how to configure your OneDrive to not sync up all that huge amount of stuff that you got up there in the cloud, right? Uh, so I haven't set up my my SkyDrive, but if you have already, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So let's let's configure my you know my SkyDrive. So what you're going to do is automatically Windows 10 already hides it. So you got this little arrow, just click on it to show whatever is hidden. Click on that OneDrive and uh, get started. Uh, most likely, if you already have OneDrive installed on your Windows 8.1 or Windows 7, it should be already signed in with no problem. So I'm going to just log in with my credentials. So let's just log in real quick. There we go. Hopefully, I'm using the right password and sign in and this is if you're doing it the first time uh, because if you're doing it the first time it gives you the option to choose which folders you want synced to your machine that's a great thing um, off the bat it actually tells you how much space is going to be downloaded if you don't choose a folder so from here introducing your OneDrive folder uh, you have an option to change the direction or the location uh, if you have a partition I'll say drop it on your D drive, E drive, don't drop it on your C drive because you'd never know. Even though if your machine crashes, you still have the information up in the cloud, right? So I'm just going to leave the default. You're going to click on next. And this is where all the folders are listed. So uh, you can pick which folder you want synced. I'm going to just uncheck all of it. And I just want to um, sync my BTN HD stuff down. It's real small, so it shouldn't take that long and from here click next if you have all of them synced it's gonna basically pull or push now 1.4 gigs and that's a lot of information for me uh, most likely you have more information than me you probably have maybe like 10 gigs 20 gigs but all the information is gonna get stored locally to your machine that's gonna take space you don't want that so I'm gonna uncheck that again I'm gonna check off uh, BTN HD so let's click on next and let me use OneDrive to fetch yeah we're done and it's gonna start syncing up that's great and there we go awesome but let's say you already had your OneDrive already configured and you you know it's already signed in it's already synced up that 20 gigs of information uh, what you could do is click on the little arrow to show the hidden stuff and you're gonna right click on your OneDrive and click on settings and within settings you want to go to the choose folders click on the choose folders button and right there, there's, there's your option. You could uncheck BTN HD or whatever folder and just check the ones that you want. Okay? And I say, guys, that is how you configure your OneDrive to only sync one particular folder and to save some space. That's pretty awesome because you probably don't need all the folders that you have in your, in your OneDrive, right? And uh, that's it, guys. If you have any questions or comments, leave them right below. Don't forget about hitting that like button because it does support this guy. <laughs> and I catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.